you guys and welcome back to my channel Fall with Joelle. Today I'm going to be trying to do a TikTok trend. It's I'm pretty sure I don't know the name, but it's like a characteristic drawing like of yourself, like the real you. Like let's say you had a sister, you would draw this. And then let's say you had a brother, you would draw a different thing. So um basically that's what it is. So um I have done this before. Um, I will be showing you guys at the end of the video what um, I did before and if you want you guys can vote down in the comments below and I will be giving a shout out um, at the end of this video and if it's you please comment down below and like your own comment and I will heart that comment and subscribe to you. So let's get on with the video. So first off we're going to be watching the video so here's the video to start customizing our character. Let's go again. Day two. Theories. You can choose to make them female or male presenting because, I mean, they're fairies, what does it matter? Their skin should be your favorite color. If you're female, give them dragonfly wings. If you're male, butterfly wings. If you fall somewhere else in the spectrum, make them fold down like beetle wings. Color the wings to match your birthday season. Do you celebrate Christmas? Give them antlers. Hair color doesn't matter, but if you have short hair, give them long hair. If you have long hair, give them short hair. Do you have an older sibling? Give them a pet bug. Do you have a younger sibling? Give them a tail. No siblings? Give them some antenna. Here we go! So, as the girl said in the TikTok, the theme is fairies. So, let's see all the characteristics. I have on my fairy. As she said, the skin should be my favorite color, and my favorite color is pink, so the skin will be pink. Since I'm female, I have dragonfly wings. My birthday season was spring. So, I'm going to be doing bright colors like um, yellow, orange, and red. Since I do celebrate Christmas, I'm giving her antlers. I have short hair, so I'm giving him long hair. And I think the hair color should be brown. Mine is a dark brown, though. I have an older sibling, so I'm giving her a pet bug. I also do have a younger sibling, so I'm also giving her a tail. So let's get on to being creative. So obviously first I am sketching. I'm starting with the head and the shoulders and one of the arms will be presenting the bug which is a fly and the other arm will just be regular straight down. I'm going to be starting off the outfit which is a dress with the waistband on the waist and um, ruffles at the bottom and the sleeves of the dress. I'm doing legs that looks like she's flying and flasher shoes, whatever fairy shoes. Um, now I'm starting with the eyes and the mouth. The mouth was pretty easy. I just did it like she had something in her mouth. I tried doing her eyes cute, like anime eyes with stars in them. And, um, um, but they started looking kind of creepy. I gave her a winky eye and I tried doing really long hair, but it ended up looking kind of weird. So I just did the long hair. Now I'm doing the antlers and started off the background a little bit. I fixed up the eyes. And I'm finishing up the background. Mm -hmm. And I did the tail. And I'm doing the wings now. So now I'm coloring the skin color pink. Okay, so now that the skin coloring is done, I am going to be coloring in the wings in... Uh, red, orange, and yellow, and I am blending all those colors together. Okay. 
Okay, so now that the wings are done, I am doing the hair light brown and the antlers in a, a really antlers in a really dark brown. Uh, and I'm doing the fly ingredients of blues and giving it um, um, red, orange, and yellow wings, just like my character's wings. I'm giving her a gradient of purples for her dress. I also colored her eye with like, I think a purple, I can't really tell. Now I'm coloring the shoes, flats, whatever, furry shoes, you know, like whatever you want to call them. I'm coloring them light blue and I'm doing the background in rainbow triangles. As you can see, I'm coloring the tail in a gradient of blues. Well, that's for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Snapchat. And I will see you in next week. And today's shout-out will be in the next clip. Or let me just put it right here. Today's shout-out is... was you make sure to comment down below that it was you and i can subscribe to you and um i will like all, i will watch some of your videos so um thank you guys so much for watching again thank you for all the feedback and i'm so excited that i'm doing all these um art videos now and also that um i'm starting to do shout outs because it's actually really fun um it's just, I feel like it's just getting my channel more active with things. Um, don't forget to, um, now, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Snapchat. And I will see you next week. Bye! And also, guys, we cannot forget about the name. The name is Mary the Fairy and her cousin, Megan the Fairy. So do you like Mary or Megan? Mary or Megan? Um, to be honest, I like I like Megan better than Mary. But it is your guys' decision. And if you want me to do any other TikTok challenges or like any challenges, um, you can either like send me the link to it um, or like. You can comment down below the link to it in the comment section, section or like, I don't know, just like, suggest something like, hey Joelle, you should do like this challenge, like characteristic drawing challenge or whatever. I'll search it up on Google or YouTube and I will try and find it for you guys. Um... And again, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Um, follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Snapchat. And I will see you guys next week. Bye!